So you have a toaster, and you wanna run GTA 5 on it, okay so let's go for it. What's up everyone, it's Rex, and you're watching Fierce Rex YouTube channel. Today, in this video, I'll show you guys, some easy fix for lag spikes while driving. In my previous video, one of my viewers commented for this video, so yeah do suggest me on the topic you want my next video on. I'll go for that. So let's start with today's tutorial. First of all, I won't go for all basic optimization, as I've shown them in my this video, you can click here, if you haven't seen the video yet. So I'll only show you some quick fixes for stutter issues while driving in-game. Well, while driving the game stutters, because of rendering. GTA 5 is an enormous game, so the game doesn't render all of its places at once. It just keeps a small chunk rendered and renders the game as your player moves chunk to chunk. So when you move chunk to chunk very fast especially while driving, your PC gets the load of rendering all the textures as fast as possible, and as your PC is mostly a toaster. It messes it up and causes frame freeze, what we call stutter. So to fix it, you either have to upgrade your PC or sacrifice your game's quality. And in this video we're gonna go for the second option. With each step I'm about to show you, you're gonna lose quality and gain performance. So find the sweet spot you want to experience your game. After every step, check out your game, if it is playable or not. If it is then stop going further with steps, and if it's not, then just continue doing the steps. Step number 1, Command Line. Right click on your game and press on Open File Location. Now make a notepad here. And name it, Command Line. Now open it. Write out the things shown in the screen. Now check your game if it's okay for you or not. Step number 2, Resolution, only follow this if you're still not satisfied with the performance. Go to Game Settings, Now lower your resolution, lower the resolution better, the performance. I'm gonna go with this one, as 800 into 600 is a little too blurry. Now check again if you're okay with the performance or not. If you're not, here comes step number 3, exit the game, and go to documents, Rockstar Games, GTA 5. Now open the settings file with a notepad, Here is the shadow quality. Change it to zero. Now save it. Exit and run the game again.
It's night, so you can't see shadows now. Let's make it day. Okay now, you can clearly see shadows are gone, play it again to see if you get stutter or not. I have one final step which I would only recommend if your game is really not playable. Step number 4, frame scaling, go to your game settings, advanced graphics, here is the frame scaling mode, set this to half. Apply changes. And yeah, the game won't be laggy at all. Okay so that's all for today guys. Anyways if you're still not subbed, I would really recommend you to subscribe as it would mean a lot to me. Also don't forget to like as it would encourage other viewers to try this method. Okay so with all due respect, love your parents, respect your country, and most importantly, take care of yourselves. See you in another video, till then. Bye bye.